It all comes down to luck in this wild, wicked world. But luck doesn't have infallibility. For luck had the nerve to make me one who serves, when it's plain to see I ought to be nobility. Even the Countess treats me with superior respect. I'm clearly her favorite in the house. She hinted once that should she ever marry, she hoped someone like me would be her spouse. So, what's the likely theory to a spouse? I could be Count Malvolio, Lord of the Estate, dressed in all the finest silks and master of my fate. I'd summon all my minions in a most majestic tone And once they've all arrived, I'd tell them, leave me alone Just picture Count Malvolio Married up and up Watching all my fortunes as they grew They'll all wish they'd been nice Once I reload the dice When I finally get my due I'd send seven servants off to fetch my Uncle Toby and wait there with the most impatient frown. I'd fiddle with my diamond studded wristwatch as I lounge upon a bed of lovely down. Then Toby would approach me with a curtsy. I'd extend a regal hand for him to kiss. <laughs> but rather than my customary curtsy, I'd indubitably lecture him like a now that I'm married to the Countess, <laughs> at last it is my right to speak the truth. You must amend your drinking and carousing, and that Andrew friend of yours must go. He's simply uncouth. And he'd say, Count Malvolio, please forgive my flaws. I'm just a lousy liar who thinks he's above the laws. If only you could teach me how to be so refined. And I'd say, sorry, Toby, there's no hope for your vulgar mind. Imagine Count Malvolio, honored and adored. My destiny will all be coming true. And they all wish they'd been sweet. Well, they can kiss my feet when I finally get my due. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. What have we here? Why, my life, this is my lady's hand. To the unknown beloved, this and my good wishes, her very phrases, to whom should this be? Jove knows I love, but who? Lips do not move. No man must know. No man must know. What follows, no man must know. If this should be thee, Malvolio, <laughs> I may command where I adore, but silence with bloodless stroke my heart doth gore. M O A I doth sway my life. Excellent one, say I. <laughs> M O A I doth sway my life. Let me see, let me see. I may command where I adore. What? She may command me. I serve her. She's my lady. What should that alphabetical position portend? If I could make that resemble something in me. Softly. M O A I! Oh, I make up that. <laughs> M. Mm -hmm. Malvolio. M. That begins my name. Did not I say you would work out? <laughs> M! Oh, but then there is no consonancy in the sequel. A should follow, but O does. <laughs> and I comes behind. M O A I. Every one of these letters is in my name. <laughs> Soft. Here follows prose. I could marry this wench for this device. <laughs> if this fall into thy hand, revolve. <laughs> what? Oh, there's more. <laughs> in my
my stars, I am above thee. But be not afraid of greatness. Some are born great, some achieve greatness, and some have greatness thrust upon them. Be opposite with a kinsman, surly with servants. Remember who commended thy yellow stockings and wish to see thee ever cross guarded. I say, remember, if thou entertainest my love, let it appear in thy smiling. Dear my sweet, I prithee, farewell. Signed, the fortunate, unhappy. I knew I wasn't dreaming or getting carried away. My lady truly loves me, her missives plain as day. The clues are running up, the letters in my name. Now all I have to do is play a game. Then I'll be Count Malvolio if I play along. Act early to the servants and tell Toby that he's wrong. I'll sport my yellow stockings and cross garter every lace. And they'll always wear a monumental smile on my face Cause I am Count Malvolio I will ace each test My fortunate unhappy puts me to My instructions are clear 